Welcome back to another episode of Bourbon Buddies. Today, something a little special, I think. It is special. It is special. Just like you, buddy. Oh, thanks, buddy. You too. <laughs> um, something that we can't get here in the state. So, mm, something mm. I picked up on an adventure, a trip. Big adventure. State, big adventure. So, what do we have, buddy? Well, straight from Kentucky, today we have Heaven Hill. Six year. The very famous, oh, the very sought after. That's a geez. solid piece of wood there, buddy. I almost <laughs> broke the pot. Wouldn't that <laughs> suck? <laughs> That's our review. Done. So what do we know about this? This is a Kentucky-only special. You only can get it in Kentucky. Typical Heaven Hill mash bill. And they age it for six years. So it's got an age statement right on the front. And they bottle it 90 proof. Now, a lot of people got really upset about, you know, the Heaven Hill discontinuing their six year bottled and bond. And then they like released a seven year bottled and bond um, with like triple the price. <laughs> and then yeah, didn't offer it in Kentucky. So people got really? mad about it. Yeah, they but don't. They, so people in Kentucky got bent, but they have other stuff they're not allowed to get. Or that True. They so, have that we don't get. Yeah, and you know, for the price point, I think it was $13 or $15, I don't remember now. I bought a whole bunch of stuff when I was there. Six year age stated bourbon, 90 yeah. proof? Ooh, Even hello. if it's $15, I mean, who's, who's belly aching? But it, oh, it yeah. was, I want to say it was right around 15 bucks. I'm hopping on my bourbon pogo stick and getting right to that, <laughs> right to the bottle and right the back bag. It's got a great color. Yeah, that six years has really done a number on it. It has an interesting nose on it. Now granted, we did just crack it, so. I get a little of that alcohol note, but I'm really getting cherry cutting through. Yeah, it's traditional nose, but there is a little bit of uh, stickiness to it. Getting like a butterscotchy kind of yeah. icing kind of thing going on. Definitely, yeah. The icing, a little doughy in there. The cherry's really popping through. It is. The big difference between this, obviously, than the, the regular Heaven Hill, I think just on the nose is the, obviously the, the, the proof, 10, 10 proof points, but also the um, with the age, it's just, I, don't, I think it just, Things are starting marries. to come together. Marries it marries together. In there. All right, I'm putting my lips on it, buddy. I'm not fooling around. Cheers. Let's let's do it, buddy. Cheers. Get a little corn note cutting through. That yeah, corn peaks up real quick. Yeah, it does. Prairie dogs on you. Cherry notes are there. Mm -hmm. There's a nice caramel sweetness there. Um, it does have a nice sweetness to it. Yeah, more kind of going toward the vanilla side of things. Yeah. The age is interesting because I, I was expecting a little bit more you know, six years it isn't too crazy of age, but I was expecting no, a little bit not. more tannin from the barrel. I don't know if I'm really No, I'm not kidding. I was just looking if there was any more information. They kind of yeah. don't really say a whole lot about, they say it's a custom made mash. Custom made for Custom you, made. Buddy. I'll be honest. I just had um, Evan Williams bottled and bond the other day. And this, honestly, I think this smokes it. I think this out for like, for sure. I'm going to use that, that, key word here smooth um it's it's definitely smooth it's just it's more put together that six years really i think you know is showing to, the something. flavors are starting to morph together and it's actually be kind of becoming one you're not getting a lot of separate mm -hmm. flavors happening i mean yes you can pick it apart but you're not getting like whoa it's heavy corn uh, but there's a little bit of this where they're kind of divided and, and separated yeah it's more it's starting to come together it's starting to blend it's starting to become become one if you will nice finish it's almost if you um would finish good. a piece of wood like if it's just a rough cut of piece of wood but you polish it you know sand it put a coat on there looks good a couple coats <laughs> this has got a couple coats on it's got it a couple coats yeah yeah and for the price point i mean this might be one of the best values in in bourbon but where can you get it kentucky only kentucky how are they producing at such a low price point for six years and Pretty they got a lot of they have a lot of a lot of bourbon at Heaven Hill. Mm. Oh, they do. Jesus. When they start telling you how many rick houses they have and how many whole, you start doing the math, you break it down the bottles. We did the math one time and it was like, it was Crazy. millions of bottles. Oh my God. Yeah. I'm kind of, uh, I'm kind of torn right now. I think it's really good for the money. And it was kind of exciting to, to, to try it and get our hands on just because you can't find it around here. Would you buy this? As an everyday sipper, or where you think it's it's, oh, yeah. it's drinking that good to you that you'd buy it for an everyday I'd, sipper. So when you're getting to this price point, it's hard not to just still buy have it. Just yeah, oh, yeah. And that alcohol, that just pour that, all over you, like ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> where is a cologne? Yeah, it's just. 
brush your teeth with it in the morning. <laughs> you know, with a price point like this, it's hard not to have that uh, that kind of astringent astringency uh, or you know, like that e ethanol kind of in, in the background. Yeah, I'm getting um, a little bit of that. It's hard to not have that in something that's this inexpensive, you know? You're gonna have a little bit of that here. Uh, it's not like Heaven Hill, yeah. um, they're 80 proof. It's like, oh, whoa. I mean, no offense, Heaven Hill, but that stuff's but it's meant It's a little for, offensive, because that yeah. stuff is offensive. I mean, there again, that stuff's if, meant if for you're just mixing. like pouring it in something, mixing it, yeah. you're not gonna notice it. And that's what a lot of people do with it. And, and that's really where I would put this. It's, it's not, budget, man. But it's, it's budget. It's right? damn good, as you said it. Hey, you know what? Let's, it's let's damn call, good for the price. Let's call it high value. But <laughs> yeah, see, I don't yeah, even yeah. know if it's high value. Would you say it's high value? I think you're getting a lot of. I say. I say. <laughs> I say you're getting a lot of bang for your buck. I mean. You think so? I think you are. I, I mean, think so too. I'm but, just kind of playing devil's advocate a little bit. You jerk. I know. Let us know what you, what you think. Uh, we definitely read all the comments. We're excited about that. We, we love hearing from you guys. Maybe if you've had a good experience, bad experience, or just what your thoughts are with it, we, we're definitely eager to hear about that. So from the Bourbon Buddies, cheers. Cheers. Wind noise, wind noise. All right, these oh, things are good. <laughs> we have a problem. We should get comms like that with your thing. Be like, buddy. Hot deal in aisle, whatever. Seven. Seven. <laughs> See the four roses. Turn your knife! Just, it's on your six now. Stop. <laughs> Just stop walking. A... You're circling. You're circling. <laughs> You're getting hot. You're getting warm. You're getting warm, warm. you're getting ah, cooler, you're getting cooler. <laughs>